Hey, what's up? This is Spider Prime One back again with another Transformers video review. All right, I'm looking at the other deluxe record that we have, Top Spin. Now, Top Spin is the um, Lowe's Jimmy Johnson number 48 car, um, and as you can see, he is in his weaponized form, whereas Roadbuster was just the sleek NASCAR with no weapons other than the the mech tech weapon on top. Um, but I like the weaponized form better on the deluxe versions. Um, I have the Human Alliance Roadbuster, um, where he's all teched out. And it looks good, but eh, it's alright. Um, and I'll get to him in, in a later review. But I do like Top Spin all teched out like this. It's really cool. Um, although the mech tech weapon here on the hood is kind of out of place, so I like to leave it off and then just give him, he's got the four chain guns, or machine guns on the sides, and then the two spikes up here in the front. So, I say he's good enough without the mech tech weapon stuck on the hood. Um, and speaking of the mech tech weapon, let's look at that real quick. It is a kind of crossbowy looking um, I, let's say pulse cannon um, just giving it a random name and then it looks like it's got a seat here like if you had a, a really small like micro master or micro machine kind of kind of dude to sit there he could sit there but when you activate the gimmick it would crush him and then the gimmick is um, the crossbow kind of turns into a claw um, and you'll see why the uh, top spin has a claw in a minute. But that's after we transform. So in order to transform him, he kind of has a animated lockdown style to the beginning of his transformation. Where you come back here and you pull on the back of the car. Right where the black and blue separate. And you pull the leg all the way, you pull the leg out and down at the same time and you fold the front piece of the car onto the front of the leg to provide like a uh, hip guard. So very locked down-ish and then to put a little twist on it you pull the little foot out here and then fold the other half of the leg up and then fold the foot all the way down. So there's that side. Come over here, bring this out and down and fold and then bring this down fold and then down so there's his legs and then what you want to do here is you fold the guns this way I do this by the instructions I think it looks pretty good this way I've seen at least five other ways you can do um, these pieces here from different reviewers I like doing it this way but what you do is you pull the, uh, the hood up here, bring this up, fold in this piece here, and then you turn the waist like so, and then you bring the legs down, um, and you connect the, uh, the waist joints right in here beneath the crotch plate. So his legs are a little more closer together. And then what you want to do is you bring the arms out just a little bit. Sorry, you can't see this. Uh, there we go. And then you come here. You fold this piece down in. Oop. Oop, oop. Sorry about that. The camera doesn't like to be up that high. Okay, come here, then you split them in half. Now the ball joints that these are on like to pop off at times, but if you hold on to them while you're doing it, it should be fine. Then you, here, let's come on this side, you fold it, I fold it forward like so, and then I fold the gray piece all the way up on the blue piece until it clicks. Sorry, I just bumped the camera. Um, and then like so, 
Then he's got his little rocket pieces. Fold this piece down. The arms you want to bring out and kind of down and then fold them out like so. Turn at the arm or the shoulder is going to go all the way back in and then turn at the arm. Um, out, down, turn at the arm and then bring the head and neck forward and that locks it in, locks the arms in. And there you have Top Spin in robot mode. Here, let's get him back into view. And there he is. There's Top Spin. Now, I like Top Spin a lot. I love the look of Roadbuster. I like the green and white deco with him. But if I had to go based on the two figure wise, Top Spin wins hand, hands down. Um, and speaking of hands down, he has molded in fists behind giant claws that do open and close. The top one opens a lot farther than the bottom one, but the bottom one does move a little bit. Um, and then the mech tech ports for him are on his forearms, so he can have two claws on one side, should you choose. But like all deluxe weapons, um, they don't lock out. They're just there. Don't know why I'm having him spread eagle. There we go. Um, now I commented on Roadbuster's head, so I'll speak on his. Um, it's actually kind of funny. He's got the sunglass eyes, and then he has the buzz cut hair on the top with dreads on the side so I didn't know that was possible but okay um, and he's very I really like this figure um, double knees double knee joints foots on an uh, on a ball joint um, hips on a ball joint he's got waist movement um, you can open and close the claws He's got elbow, swivel, sh shoulders on a ball joint. You can bring it forward on the transformation joint. Um, heads on a ball joint. And then these, just like uh, Roadbusters missile packs, can be placed however you want them. I like doing it like this. This is how I saw it in the instruction booklet. This is how I do it. Um, and... I just love the overall look to him. He looks really cool. Um, I don't know why his legs are being all awkward um, right now, but I'll deal with that when I get to it. Um, but yeah, all in all, he's a he's a really good figure. I like him a lot, and I'm so happy and yet kind of disappointed. Um, happy part. They are making a deluxe lead foot. Disappointed part? It's a Target exclusive. That's the only way you can get it because he's got the Target logo on him. Um, and since you can't sell something with the Target logo at Walmart or Kmart or whatever, he's a Target exclusive. Um, and I've heard and seen that he's coming in the November, December, maybe we have to wait until January area. But um, I can't wait till he gets here. Um, hopefully I can get lucky and get him early. That would be awesome. Um, but I can't wait to have all three wreckers for the deluxe class. Um, I know that we already ha have the possibility to get all three wreckers for the Cyberverse class. Um, and then... We're just waiting on a Human Alliance version of Top Spin. But I'm really more excited for the Deluxe. Um, but that's for a later date. But yeah, highly recommend um, Top Spin. Here, we'll pose him with Roadbuster. Stand him here. So there's the two wreckers together. Um, like I say, I like Roadbuster character-wise, but um, the figures, they're both e 
equally awesome, but I, I'd have to go for Top Spin just a little bit more. Um, but do not hesitate to pick these guys up. Um, really worth the buy. And I'm Spider Prime 1. I'll be back again with another Transformers review. Um, getting into the Voyager Autobots. But until then, uh, I'm signing off.